While PC cases don't directly influence your computer's performance, they have a really important part to play in housing your overall system. They come in different shapes and sizes with varying feature sets. Mini cases are compact in size, demand lesser space while keeping the performance uncompromised. Full tower cases, on the other hand, are super spacious and let you cram in a huge number of components inside. And lastly, the mid-tower chassis falls right between these two, with the best of both. With that being said, each of these case sizes has a specific essence of its own, and you need to go for a particular one depending on the build you have in mind. To help you with that, we will be going through each of them to give you hindsight on what form of PC case you should settle for. So without further ado, let's get started. Starting off with the mini tower PC cases, they are the smallest of the bunch. They came into existence to fulfill the demands of those who face space constraints. Gradually, they became quite popular, as people are more into minimalism rather than flashy, humongous PC cases. They take up less space, are really easy to build with, and fall right into most people's affordable range. Followed by this, plenty of popular brands are producing small form factor components, such as mini ITX motherboards, single fan graphics cards, and SFF PSUs. Combined, you can get yourself a wholesome compact build that delivers the same performance that you could get from a much bigger build. However, there are some setbacks to mini tower PC cases. While they can be quite attractive, they lack spacing to accommodate even more hardware. A gaming rig that can blaze through graphics-intensive modern games will surely require a beefy graphics card, more RAM slots, and reliable cooling capabilities. These are missing in mini cases due to their size limitations. This is where full tower PC cases come to the rescue, as they are all about capacity. Being the largest of the bunch, they can fit any number of components you throw at them. Most full tower chassis come with more than 10 expansion slots, letting you enjoy the additional video, sound, and graphical features. More room also means better cooling management, as full tower cases seamlessly support liquid cooling. Additionally, you can install a significant number of cooling fans for better overall airflow. So if you are into overclocking, these cases are hands down the best. Another awesome thing about a full tower PC case is its high amount of storage drive bays. Whether you are a gamer or content creator, having additional storage devices always serves greatly. Games these days are huge in file size, while high resolution raw footage also weighs a ton. Though building with these giants can be really expensive, as they often have plenty of components inside. Investing in cooling fans and a liquid cooling solution to keep them cool will surely hurt your wallet. The cases themselves are pretty pricey, demand plenty of space, and are really difficult to move. And that leaves us with the mid-tower PC cases. They are the sweet spot between the other two, with the appropriate amount of internal capacity and reasonable form factor. The temperature inside these cases is manageable, while they still pack a great deal of computing power. Nevertheless, they are not as compact as a mini tower and as spacious as a full tower case. So which one is the right case for you? Well, it completely depends on the building purpose you have in mind. You can go for the mini ITX case if you are into minimalism, suffer from space constraints, or looking for an affordable option. A full tower case is appropriate if you are planning on building a monstrous gaming or editing rig that can take on any demanding game or project. Also, users who have plenty of space in their room and don't mind spending on cooling components will find the full tower case appropriate. And if you want the best of both, we recommend the mid tower PC cases for you. So that was all about the mini versus mid versus full tower PC cases debate. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this one on your feed.